Hey, what's going on, people? It's another beautiful day. It's another great day. It's Chief T here, live on a Wednesday. For those that don't know, I'm in Camp Humphrey, South Korea. It is Wednesday morning, the 18th. I ain't been paying attention to the day. I think it's the 18th. Yesterday should have been the 17th. Yeah. So it's the 18th here. I know for those back in the States, it's, it's still Tuesday. It's Tuesday evening. But I had a question. For those that don't know, I love sharing wealth topics, wealth tips, things that will put you over the edge in your finances, stuff that we don't talk about on a normal basis and things we just don't know. Um, do you have a succession plan? You know, a succession plan. A plan for, you know, when you're gone. A lot of people don't have a plan and they don't focus on it. You know, a lot of people want to have kids, want to have families and whatnot. A lot of people don't. But the question is, what is your succession plan? Think about it. For those that's in the, you won't be in the too long, right? For those that are in the <laughs> in the A and uh, you got kids, um, you know you can't wheel your job over to your kids, right? It don't work like that. So yeah, you serving 15, 20 years right now. You're at 20, maybe at six. If you was to die today, they don't just put the uniform on and, and, and pick up where you left off. If you're on a job that's um, you know white collar, blue collar, whatever, and you pass away today for whatever reason, God forbid, you know, you pass away today, they can't go put the tie on, put the shirt on, put the stilettos on, whatever job it is that you are you work at and, and just pick it up and have money coming in just like that. If you have small kids, it behoove you to pay more attention. If you have older kids and they're not as successful as you, still pay attention. A succession plan is a plan that guarantees that your successor will be successful. I say again, a succession plan is a guaranteed way for your successor to be successful when you pass away. What does that look like? You got money coming in that you don't have to work for every day. You have a way to where um, if you was to pass away today, they're not just getting a check from the, the, the army or the military or something like that, but they actually have residuals coming in. They got passive income coming in to where they're able to pick up where you left off, pay all the bills, keep the family healthy, things of that nature. If you don't have that, what are you doing? To, what would you like to do to position that? What would that look like? For you, everybody's situation is different. You may have two kids. Some people have six, like me. That dollar amount, that lifestyle may be different. So the question I ask you, what is your succession plan? And have you started on your succession plan today? Or would you like to? See, if you don't have a way where your money is making money for you, you need to start now. And it's not just that. There's other things I would love to share with you that uh like your insurance current insurance rates, how they give, how they pay out, things of that nature. What's going on, Bruce? Hey, brother, you, you watching from Orlando? Man, you, you, you tour the world more than I do. <laughs> and I'm on active duty status. Hey, rep your, uh, rep your, uh, branch of service that you served with, sir. Retired. There you go. 100% VA and one tax free. I like it. I love it. I want more of it. Um, and what he's talking about is, is a retirement check. But what if you don't make it to retirement? What if you get the disability check? What are you doing for yourself today that's going to give you a guaranteed way for your successor to be successful or your successors to be successful? At the end of the day, if you was, you know pass away on active duty status, they give you $500,000. That's the current rate right now. I want you to think about how much $500,000 will last every year for the next you know, two to three years, maybe five years. I think my military check is around 72,000 a year. So, you know, family would be able to take care of themselves for a couple of years, maybe. Inflation goes up, cost of living goes up every single year, sometimes every quarter. So what's gonna be sustaining them when you're gone? Or better yet, when you're no longer working, what type of succession plan do you have? Most people say they're going to focus on the retirement check. They're going to do the disability like most military do. But what? What if that doesn't happen? You know, what if legislature changes to where there's no more 
uh, pensions for, uh, well, it's already changed for the military that, uh, that came in, I think, after 2018. What if it changed to where there's no, there's no 401ks? You know, 401k is not that old. It actually was created after the, uh, after the, the, the tax, taxes started back in, like, before 1775. Taxes started in 1775 after the Boston Tea Party and all that other stuff. It's fight, fighting over taxes, if I'm not mistaken. And 401k, I believe, uh, came around where it couldn't be over 30 years old. It can't be over 30, maybe 50 years. I'll give it 50. It's only been around, I'll give it 50. It's only been around for 50 years. So think about that. So what's the solution? I'm telling you, there's different, there are different opportunities out there. And I mentioned this the other day, um, that I have one as well. And it's guaranteed to cover every, every area of your finances, not just the succession period, your legacy, but also your lifestyle. And that's what we need to focus on. Too often our, our money doesn't pay for our, our lifestyle and our legacy. It either pays for the lifestyle, meaning the day to day and you live in check, check the check. Maybe you got a little extra cushion to go on vacations and you know, actually trips, <laughs> go on some trips, but that's usually about it. How many are actually preparing for a legacy and not just talking about it? So let's, let's get together and uh, I'd love to share more with you. It's a simple formula. Simple stands for S-I-M-P-L-E. We're going to show you how to shift your income to where you're not giving it out to the government, the banks, and big business. We're going to show you how to increase it by giving you different ways you can increase your current income. We're going to give you a way to multiply that income to where you're not just uh, letting the money sit somewhere, but that your money is actually moving. It's currency. It's supposed to move, right? Then give you a way to protect it. Think about it. If you're talking legacy, uh, and you just have all your money in the banks. If those those of y'all that haven't paid attention, I don't even watch TV. And I, I saw this, you know, uh, the bank. There's other banks that are falling out right now, declaring bankruptcy right now. So 2008 wasn't the only time the bank had a crisis. Here we are in 2024, and it's <laughs> it's falling out again. And then we're gonna give you a way and show you how to leverage everything. Think about this. I'm using a cell phone right now, all the way in a whole nother country. I'm getting a write-off on that phone, on this phone right here, as well as the internet. Are you gonna use a phone today? Are you using the internet today? Are you able to write a portion, if not all of that off? I'm gonna show you how to leverage everything that you use on a daily basis to where you can get money back every single day. That's the simple formula. If you want more information, definitely give me a call, 254-813-7088, keyword simple, or just comment below, <laughs> simple. Hope y'all got a little bit of information from this today. And y'all be blessed. Your succession plan. Do you have one? Comment simple below if you want to know a plan that's guaranteed to work. It's working for me. It can work for you. Hey, Bruce, appreciate you tuning in. Hey, your retirement pay is not taxed. His law enforcement pay is taxed. Understand that. Inbox it. I will, as well as everybody else. Make sure you inbox it, Bruce, as well. Hey, he's one of my business partners as well. I'll be blessed.